Hello friends, welcome back to my channel, Plus Size in Canada. My name is Miranda, and it's a really yucky day out here today in Moncton. It's been raining, it's a little chilly, and it's windy, it's just kind of yucky. If you are new here, hello, welcome. I'm so happy that you're here. We live in New Brunswick, Canada, and if you know the area, we live just outside of Moncton. So I do all of my shopping in Moncton and Dieppe. Um, but I'm hoping soon to take some road trips. Actually, Curtis and I really need to get the hell out of this place. <laughs> we need a break. We need a break so bad. And I'm hoping maybe at some point that will happen. I feel like it was way more of a sure thing back before the pandemic. And now actually my youngest Winnie, um, she's six. She'll be turning seven, but she has like kind of bad separation anxiety now, which I feel like totally comes from the pandemic. I feel like I got her to a point where she could be like, okay, bye mom. See you tomorrow. I'm going for a sleepover at Nanny Grampy's. Woohoo. It hasn't happened since then. It hasn't happened since the pandemic started. And we've tried it a couple times and it always fails. And it ends up with me having to go pick her up at like 10 30, 11 o'clock at night. She's crying. She needs to come home. So I'm hoping at some point Curtis and I can get away for a little bit and maybe do a little shopping for Christmas, perhaps, but I'm not holding my breath. <laughs> so yes, I am sitting outside of Walmart. I'm about to go in. The reason that I'm here today is simply to make a return. Um, if you watched my latest plus size try on, then you know I found some really good, really good Walmart finds for Christmas and Disney and it's fabulous and exciting. Um, but if you'll remember, there was one shirt in particular that was very Little House on the Prairie. And don't get me wrong, Laura Ingalls, I love those braids. Okay, like Sully, do we even need to talk about it? Okay, like one of my very first loves of all time. Okay, when Dr. Quinn, Michaela, was giving birth on the tree, I told myself, Miranda, you are never having children. <laughs> And it's a good thing for like Western medicine and C-sections because I need that. And I wouldn't have made it any other way. My body just isn't shaped right. I mean, there's a lot of shape, but on the inside, the pelvic area is pretty small. Did I need to tell you that? That might be too much information. <laughs> like I care. <laughs> Let's go into Walmart. I am going to shop around just a little bit um, to see if there's like any NBA cards for Cooper for Christmas or... Um, any like new Christmas items that are going to go quickly. Like I'm just going to do a quick scan. Um, but then next week for sure, we're skipping the Walmart and we're going to giant tiger instead. Okay. Mark my words. Actually, please don't because sometimes I change my mind. Okay. I'm a woman. That means legally I am allowed to change my mind and I'm always right. So yay me. <laughs> I'm leaving my glasses in the Jeep because I just put my mask on. And the second I pulled my mask up, my glasses got super foggy. And I was like, oh yeah, that's why I don't like to wear these in town anymore. Because you can't see anything. People with glasses that can't see any other way. I am so sorry you've been dealing with this for the last almost two full years. Man, the looks I get when I am vlogging in public. Whew. <laughs> Who does she think she is? Check the Jeep, honey. Plus size in Canada, bitch. <laughs> Okay, I'm so excited. I got my item returned, no problem at all. Um, and while I was up there, I noticed they had Pokemon cards on the back, um, like on the back shelf. And I was like, oh, they have Pokemon cards back there. Maybe they have NBA cards back there. They did. <laughs> One package. It's in my purse, I bought it. <sighs> I'm so excited. I thought I would come check the aisle too, just to see if they had any over here. Oh my shit, they do. Look how many. Okay, <laughs> calm yourself. Calm yourself, Miranda, it's okay. What do they do? How many do I buy? I've never seen this many. I've never, I've never. Okay, <laughs> okay I'm gonna call Curtis. <laughs> okay, I've calmed down a little bit. I called Curtis. 
And while the phone was ringing, I realized um, it's not NBA. That's why they were there. They are um, college ball, which is still cool, um, but I don't know how much they cost. So I was looking for one of the finger dingers where you scan. There's a screaming kid in the aisle where the other one is. So I was trying to find a different one. Anyways, I'm gonna see how much they are. And I definitely will get one, if not a couple. Anyways, okay, false alarm. But at least I did get one NBA from the counter. So not all is lost. Are those Mashems? Look how many. Are you freaking kidding me? I haven't seen Mashems in forever and there's so many of them. Hello Christmas. Looks like we're getting one. <laughs> of course I cannot come to Walmart without seeing if they have any new stuff set up for Christmas. I honestly cannot believe that it's almost Christmas time. I feel like I'm underprepared. That's because I am compared to what I usually am. But also it's like exciting to like get excited while everything's getting set up instead of months before everything gets set up. <sighs> but it, it's causing me a little bit of the sweats, guys. <laughs> I still haven't found those stinking friggin' hard to find caramel apple ones. I, I swear people must be like finding them and buying all of them right away. I really want to try just one, guys, just one. Not that I should fall in love with another candy. Let me fall in love with grapes or celery. <laughs> Winnie has been asking to get more of these chocolate bars to put in her lunch can. So of course, mama has to deliver. Decisions were made here, folks. Oreos instead of soup. <laughs> I just found Snoopy. He might just have to come home with me. Super cool. How could I not? It's still rainy and yucky, but I'm gonna head into Sobeys now and get a few more things. I mean, there's a total reason why this store is my favorite. <laughs> How pretty. I don't know if it's because I used to work at a grocery store and my eye appreciates the cleanliness, the togetherness, the organization, the colors, or if it's my OCD, who knows? The prices at Sobeys are definitely, you know, a little more expensive than most grocery stores. Um, but I understand why I keep coming back. I mean, she's hot. <laughs> she's a hot grocery store. <laughs> I just bought some of these at Walmart, but I've never seen this kind before. Party cake muffins, excuse me. Cooper might be the only one who would like these, but I think it's worth the shot for something fun. Oh, Canada, oh, 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 Canada. This is the good stuff. Ooh, the salad is really good. It's like everything but the bagel seasoning, but in a salad and can't argue with that price. I think I'm gonna do a pantry restock tomorrow. So I'm buying lots of pantry items and we're gonna try to keep it clean and stocked so that it doesn't get out of hand. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> One of these days I'm gonna find it and watch it be gross. <laughs> what? 97 cents, oh yeah. I really should go home and put this stuff away, especially because I got ice cream for Winnie. It should be put right in the freezer, <sighs> but I really need to pee, okay? Just being real. And Marshall's is right there and they have really good bathrooms. So like, maybe I should just go pee at Marshall's and see if they have any Disney stuff. Like, 
what a good idea. I just, it's only because I need to pee. Like, you know, just gonna be nice to my bladder and allow it to release, okay? <laughs> That is disgusting. <laughs> like, so gross. You guys, I cannot contain the excitement. <sighs> Deep breaths. Beautiful. It's been going on for a few minutes. <laughs> it's so loud. Some cool Star Wars ones. I found Mickey and Minnie. And I know I already have Mickey and Minnie mugs, but I don't have this kind with the top. I'm getting both. You guys, can you even believe it? Holy moly. I did make rules for myself. If you're new here, you might not know. I am a little obsessed with Disney um, and I have a mug collection. And the rules that I made for myself is that my glasses are fogging up literally because I'm still sweating. I'm so hot because I'm so excited. Um, so I uh, made a rule for myself that I was not supposed to buy mugs of characters that I already have. Um, of course, I already have many um, Minnie and Mickey ones, but <laughs> this guy just looked at me so confused. Like, what is that? She, is she FaceTiming? <laughs> What's she doing? <laughs> um, anyways, so that's the rule. If I already have the character, I probably shouldn't get it unless it's something super special or unless it's for a specific season, like fall, Halloween, Christmas, um, Valentine's Day, you know, like certain theme things. I'll buy like repeats of characters. Um, but I do want to branch out and like find like, you know, characters that aren't always found. Like Stitch is easy to find these days. Minnie and Mickey are usually pretty easy to find, but I have never seen the Minnie and Mickey with the lids. One of my friends sent me a stitch one with the lid. It is literally eye catching. It's just so tall and so much bigger than the other ones that it just catches your eye and it's beautiful. And now I'm gonna have Minnie and Mickey. I can't, I, um, oh, oh my heck. Okay, I gotta go home. I gotta go home because the ice cream is probably melting. I bought her four boxes of those dang friggin' Smarty ice creams. And literally, she doesn't even eat the cone. Okay, she literally will eat the little tiny scoop of ice cream off the top of the damn cone. And then she'll take a spoon and get all the ice cream out that she can. And then she gives the cone away to whoever wants it. Usually it's Curtis eats the cone. I just like, I don't know. I can't explain it, you guys. She's just such a picky eater. And I even saw in the store they had um, Scaries, like a Halloween version of Smarties. And literally, it's the same Smartie. They changed the box to make it look like there's a ghost on it with orange and white um, Smarties instead of like rainbow Smarties. Literally, she would not eat those. She literally would not eat them because they're in a different box. They're a different color. We One of our friends sent us some um, Canada Day Smarties in the summer and they were white and red. Nope. Nope. She wasn't even going to try one. Absolutely not. And actually, I think I did make her try one. Like, got mad and said, you are trying one of these Smarties right now. And she didn't like it. But she likes real Smarties. Seems legit, eh? There's many parents out there that are living the same struggle I am. Let's just laugh together, okay? Because it does get better. It does. My boys are already getting better. Um, they still like their specific foods that they've always liked, but they do branch out a little bit. And I was a little bit picky when I was a kid, and I will eat anything now. <laughs> just, you know, shh, just stop. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> tell your mom I'm sorry that I'm a bad influence okay but also tell her like I'm really nice and I'm cool to hang out with and like also like share the video with her maybe she'll laugh too you know what I'm saying <laughs> okay I'm gonna drive home and I will show you guys everything that I bought there hi buddy hi check the bag check the bag that's right in front of you how much four boxes <laughs> Do I know my girl? Oh yeah. You guys, look what Winnie made for me. <laughs> oh, I 
love her so much. How did she know? She actually didn't know that I just bought Mickey a mini mugs, but we're on the same wavelength, you guys. <laughs> Marty McFly coming in on the hoverboard. <laughs> Okay, the kids are downstairs playing ping pong, so you're gonna hear it, and I'm sorry in advance if it bothers you. It bothers me too. <laughs> hey, Queen, check out all the craft dinner I bought. <laughs> yeah, baby. Seashells, original, um, ABCs, and white cheddar. Yeah, because what do you like the most? Yeah, baby. <laughs> okay, Winnie's going to start putting stuff away. So we got a whole bunch of seashells. You want to count them for me? Because okay. I can't really remember how many I picked up. Seven. How many? Seven. Seven. That's a good number. Mm -hmm. Nice. So the craft dinner was on sale for 97 cents. Honestly, I was literally only going to Sobeys to find Winnie the ice creams and i just thought i would take a look around i have a headache if you can't tell i'm a little bit struggling right now i've had a headache all day and um I i've been taking tylenol and advil and like sometimes i'm like oh yeah it's gone and then it's like never mind <laughs> it's back um i also took some diet coke um and also i took some sour patch kids because maybe they'll help <laughs> So I also got a bunch of original ABCs and a few white cheddars. I actually picked up a couple by accident. I picked up some sharp cheddar, but I didn't buy sharp cheddar because I picked it up by accident. I thought it was white cheddar. It was in the same lineup, but I gave it to the cashier and I was like, can you just keep this? Because I picked it up by accident. I don't think my daughter would eat sharp cheddar. Would you even try it? I already tried it. I wouldn't try it. You wouldn't try sharp cheddar? I would not. Why? Because it sounds gross. Okay, haters, come at Curtis with your comments. It's your fault she's picky. It is definitely my fault she's picky. And it's my fault she sometimes says bad words. <laughs> she's a crazy nut. Yeah. <laughs> she's not medicated yet. So, Lots of years I left put, for that, sis. I, I put all the craft dinner. <laughs> I put all the craft dinner back, but one was lonely. It didn't have a spot to go with it. So it was lonely? I had to go on the other side. Oh, dang it. Do you want to put all your craft dinner away? That would be amazing. I would love your help. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, she touched the package of hot dogs. Heaven forbid. Heaven forbid. Look at you, queen. Whoa. Are you for real? Are you for real? Are you for real? Real? Are you for real? She's doing it. She's doing it. Holy crap, she's awesome. She's the crap dinner queen. <laughs> oh, I love you. <laughs> You're so awesome. I grabbed this package of ground beef just because I noticed it was like a value pack. It was on sale. It was $8 for quite a large pack. So happy to grab that. I'll probably cook it tomorrow because I think the kids want craft dinner and hot dogs for supper. And I'm not going to argue because I don't feel very good. So, um, the easier, the better. Um, this is the kind of bread that I've made before and it turned out so good and delicious. And my family's been bugging me ever since to make it again. So I'm going to have to at some point, probably soon, cause I really do like to bake in the fall. Um, but this is the oatmeal brown bread. It's not whole wheat bread. I know some places call whole wheat bread, brown bread. We don't here in the Maritimes, we call it whole wheat bread. Um, but brown bread is bread made with a secret ingredient of molasses. It's sweet. It goes really good with cheese. And if you've ever been to a potluck dinner or some kind of like lunch in, there's a very good chance that you will see a platter of brown bread buttered and with some cheese cut up on the side. Anyways, that's hard to find. You can, you usually find it at bakeries around here. Um, but Sobeys sells this brother's bakery kind so I always try to grab it when I go. <laughs> um, I got this um, fruit platter. Basically, it's because it looked pretty. Okay. And I was like, mmm, fruit. And it's pretty. And it's ready to eat. And I don't have to do anything to it to make it ready. 
So there's no excuse. Like, even though I just ate two packages of the small packages, but yeah, two of them of the Sour Patch Kids. Um, but I'm going to eat some of this next. That'll probably help my headache even more than the sugar. Come on, Miranda, do better. But actually, like, sometimes I think my headaches are because of sugar. Um, especially when I'm not eating as much as I sometimes do because I feel like it's my brain um, saying like, we want sugar, we want sugar. And sometimes when I eat something sugary, it goes right away, but it didn't this time. So but I do suffer with migraines and I've been actually really good with my migraines lately. I do take um, nightly medication, a very large dose. I can't, I always, whenever I talk about this, I can never remember the name of that medication. Um, but anyways, it's these pills. I take them every night prescribed and, um, um, oh shoot, North Triptyline, the Triptyline, something like that. Anyways, I take it every night and that's supposed to help me not get migraines, which it, it does help like a lot. We've upped the dose multiple times. So maybe I'm going to get back to the place where we'll have to up it even more. <laughs> But my poor liver, like, does that go through the liver? Probably. I drink a lot, okay? <laughs> and I'm on a lot of medication. So I'm basically just like a tornado of issues. But I mean, she's cute. So what girl doesn't have issues, okay? Everyone's got issues. These hot dogs were on sale for under $2. So I grabbed a couple packs of those. Skylar specifically asked for lemonade. So I got him that. It's not the same kind that I got last time at um superstore so i didn't want to buy more than one because i'm not sure if he's gonna like it um but i am gonna try to stay stocked up on juice like this because it's actually saving quite a bit of money it's not as convenient um but the kids like to make their own juice so i gotta find out which ones are the best and then i will stock up i got one of these salads and i realized the reason why they were on sale is because the due date's in two days um, so I'll probably eat this. I was going to eat it for supper, but I don't know if I'm going to eat supper because I just really don't feel good. Um, but, uh, I don't know. I'm going to eat it. Whatever. $3. <laughs> I got some of those Ritz crackers. Skylar was super excited to see those in the bag. Are you noticing who asked me for those? Me. Yeah. So mommy hooked you up, girl. Don't even worry about it. Mama's got you. Uh, Evelyn said that there was lots. There's little kinds of these. Like, yes. Like two pieces. Yeah, they're really small. They're a Halloween candy style. He should buy them. So maybe I buy some. Oh, you want mommy to buy the little ones too? Or maybe you could buy them. I can. This is my snack. And then I can say, Emily, I have the snack and I'm breaking apart. <laughs> <laughs> if you want the little ones, mommy can buy you the little ones too. It's just yeah. they're not as much chocolate. Can... There's only just those yeah. two little squares. But they are delicious. Headache. You have a headache? Are we headache twins? Oh, babe. This package here is a complete ripoff. It's like literally $6.99 for six small bags of Skinny Pop. But I just wanted to get this for the kids. It's nice to have sometimes, um, and the kids take it in their lunch, and it's just nice to have a little change. Um, they have this giant pack of TP on sale for $11 and some kind of sense. Anyways, it's apparently a very good deal. So I was like, okay, I believe that. Looks like a big pack. We'll take it. Curtis put himself on a break from regular everyday chips. So I decided to get him a few healthier choices. So I got him some barbecue crispy minis and some sweet chili crispy minis. We know about these. I showed you guys in the store. So I grabbed that. And also mama needed some more maple syrup to go with my um, special protein pancakes and I found baking powder. I just walked by it, and honestly, I always forget baking stuff. I always run out, and I don't get more, and then I have to make a special trip, and I'm annoyed by it. Um, so I've decided, like, once I know I'm getting low on something, if I see it, I'm just going to pick it up. So that's why I did that. I didn't get very much food from Walmart, but I did get some fun things, so I'll show you that in a minute. Um, but I got some brownie little bites, some blueberry ones, and some chocolate chip. I got three boxes of these Oreo cookies. These are $2 each, so that's a pretty good deal for six packages. And again, for my baby, because he's on his chip break, some Milli Melo and some crispers, both barbecue flavor. Of course, the chocolate bars, and these are the kind of granola bars Winnie will eat. Unfortunately, they do not come in the um, peanut-free op option, so she can't take them to school, but... She can't eat them at home. 
Curtis requested some more Sweet Baby Ray's. This has got to be like one of the most expensive barbecue sauces out there. So I'm going to try to stock up when it's on sale because it was $3.79. $4 bottle of barbecue sauce. That just seems like a lot to me. Um, and then I talked about my favorite great value Chipotle sauce, the Chipotle mayo. It hasn't been there the last three times I've been at Walmart. So I think you guys probably bought it all and that's okay. Walmart just needs to order more. <laughs> But because I'm out of my favorite, I decided I would buy these Heinz bottles. This one's a garlic aioli, and this one is a hot and spicy aioli. I think aioli is just a fancy word for mayo. Anyways, um, but I got those to try because I love a sauce. I'm a saucy queen. I love sauce. All the sauces, different tasting sauces. You can call me the sauce boss if you want. I'll take that title. <laughs> Okay, I'm down in my room and I'm gonna show you the stuff that I got for Christmas. And this is just the beginning, um, but I got a few things so I wanna show you. I would love to get like 10 boxes of basketball cards and put them all in one box and then have him open it. And then like, there's just a whole bunch of basketball cards in it. So, but already right here. Okay, there <laughs> Curtis is down here. Um, okay, I don't wanna know how much this it one. Is. Forty dollars. I don't want to know this. And this no. one, thirty-four. The content's not going to be real here. It's going to be like <laughs> forty so bones. What does Cooper want for Christmas? Nah, he doesn't like them anymore. I talked about it. Oh yeah. No, he, he likes them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he'll like it. It's just crazy. Okay, you'll like these because they were a lot cheaper than that. Okay. See if you know it there just by looking at the package. Don't say it out loud. Just say it quietly. Do you know what they are? Are they... Are you reading labels? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. You don't know what they are? No. Mashups. Yeah. I knew that. Do you remember she used to have... Well, we still, still do does, have a lot of them. them every once in a while. Yeah. Isn't that fun? I Not a whole bunch. Right now. So bad. <laughs> Juggling, not one of your talents, babe. Very true. <laughs> I got two blues clues, two Peppa Pigs, two Disney princesses, and two Barbie ones. Oh, I love this so much. We used to buy those for Winnie like every time we went to town, and we would always buy two at a time because she always needed one for each hand. And that was literally like, that's something that her grandmother talks to her about all the time because she always needed two toys, one for each hand. And she would, oh my land, she wouldn't let them go. They would be with her for the whole day. And it's just, she still does like them. We still play with them sometimes. We, it's one of the put away toys. So we have so many toys in the house because I used to run a daycare. Now I just babysit two kids full time. Um, but we have so many toys. We've given a lot away. But um, what we do now is we put some away in bins and then we take them out for like special playtime and it makes the kids like way more excited to actually play with them because they haven't seen them in a long time. But anyways, it's just, I've never found so many in one store. So I was really excited to find that. And I can't, that actually might be for her birthday instead of Christmas. Cause I don't know if I can wait that long. <laughs> Now pretend that I'm trying this on and it fits wonderfully. I don't want to try it on. I just, you guys know, you already know why. I just, I'll wear it tomorrow probably. $18. I got it in a 4X because it is cropped. Um, but when you buy bigger, it's longer. There's an inappropriate comment in there somewhere. <laughs> hey, little ice maker queen. What do you think of my new mugs? Aren't they so cool? It's almost like you knew mm -hmm. that I was buying those mugs today, huh? I did. <laughs> you did? Are we like twin brains? I don't think she needs a twin brain to know you're gonna buy something Disney, baby. Yeah, that's probably a good call. You're the best. I love you. What is this, a cockroach? <laughs> Did you just see Pete walk by? Did you see Petey? <gasps> Did you see Winnie? <laughs>
I think Lulu's coming over. <laughs> we got a gourmet dinner of buried treasure for the younger boys. Craft dinner and hot dogs for the biggest boy. And Queen's already eaten her craft dinner. Is it good? Uh -huh. All right. And I had a couple of bites of the craft dinner while I was making it. And I'm having a Smirnoff. <laughs> Fruit too. I'm all about that health and fitness, you know? <laughs> tonight with my brother and sister and dad but because it's thinking COVID everything's closed and it was league night at the one place that was actually open so yeah so we didn't go bowling um but we had a ping pong tournament here instead and we just sat around had some drinks and chatted for a bit um, my brother's going back to British Columbia early Saturday morning so um, we think we might hang out tomorrow night, but we're not 100% sure. It depends on the weather. Anyways, it was fun hanging out with them, and we're going to end the vlog. It's 9.30. We have to wake up early, and Winnie is just now having her midnight snack. So we're not done homework either, but we're going to worry about that in the morning. Because Uncle Josh only comes here like once every like six years, so it's a special time. So anyways, we love you guys. Thanks for hanging out with us today. And guess what? My headache's gone. I just needed two drinks. <laughs> Love you guys. We'll see you tomorrow.